Hello, hello, everybody. Welcome. If you're new here, my name is Nandipa. Welcome, welcome, and welcome. If you are an oldie, oh my god, your support is so greatly appreciated. I love you lots like jelly tarts. So, kind of in a hurry, I have to leave in four minutes. Um, today uh, it's Monte Carlo, and I'm going to the perfumer perfumery. So looking forward to it. Oh, I need my earrings. Oh my god, I need earrings. So looking forward to it. So um, just thought I'd come and introduce him. Let's go. problem here maybe you also already heard it when you were in Italy we have really a lack of rain that's our Toma is able to pay the pay toll here automatically but if you're sitting in a car you go over there on the left and you put the money in a basket and coins and if you're lucky the rest comes out again that's why that's why I always drive my car behind foreigners because they don't really know exactly how it works so sometimes I have a free uh, motorway here because I find the rest of those who've been there before <laughs> naturally you can also pay by credit cards <laughs> now we have the river Bar on our right side so you can see, say that before 18. Okay, here we are at the perfumery. I'm not even going to try to pronounce it. Let's go in. Okay. 
Toilet? Dancer. Water? Merci. Okay. Which is one of the cheapest. We need 120 kilo of lavender. So it's not bad already, but you know we have a lot of lavender in Provence. I have to tell you, we have lavender. <laughs> So, perhaps you paid attention, I didn't mention yet, yet rose or jasmine, mm -hmm. because those two flowers, we use them a lot in perfumes, but they are very delicate. I mean, if we distill them, we burn them, so the scent we obtain is not perfect. For this reason, we use another process called this time with fat. Think about it. When you have in your fridge at home some butter and a melon, you know what happens? The melon is not onto the butter, but the butter is going to take the scent of the melon. So long years ago, the people used pork and beef fat, but it became rancid very quick. So today, because it's more natural, we use glycerine, which comes, you know, from the sunflower, mixed with Vaseline. So look. We use such glass frames, glass boxes. It looks to me like for the bees, for the honey. We put the fat and onto the fat, we put two ends of flowers. So you understand the fat is going to absorb the scent and that's what we want. But we want as well the fat to become saturated of the scent. And for these ladies and gentlemen by hand, Every two days, we have to remove the old flowers to put new ones, and we do that on the same fat for one month. So, you see what I mean? I told you this was the cheapest, now you understand why those are so expensive. Mm -hmm. After one month, we collect the scented fat, we put it in the beaters I've got there behind me, and we add ethanol alcohol, the purest. We blend them together for about 24 hours, so you see what I mean, the alcohol is going to wash the fat and take the scent of it. So the fat goes down, the alcohol goes up, the fat we treat it for making scented soaps, good for the skin because you have glycerin inside. We need 800 kilo to make one liter. Can you believe that? You see what I mean? It's like mountains of flowers we need. The rose, perhaps you have it, I think in the States, in, in flowers of the States, I think you have it. Um, it's just the rose you have there, just there behind you. This rose. It looks like a peony. It's a old rose we had before in our grandmother's gardens. You know, you can't leave it in a flask because the petals, they fall down very quick but the scent is just marvelous. The problem, it grows only one month a year in May and we need one ton. Oh, wow. So, you see what I mean? In this area, we are lucky because during all the year, we have a microclimate, which means we have a very big diversity, but we don't have enough. So we have to import from all over the world and we never transport the flowers because, of course, we need them fresh. And you imagine the place it will take in a plane as well. So we have directly in the countries, I'm going to tell you, small factories. They treat the flowers the same way we do and they send us the finished oil so there's no waste. So the jasmine comes from India, Egypt and Italy and the rose comes from Turkey. Bulgaria and Morocco. Good? Important because it keeps perfume dark and cool. So I would like to give you a friend advice. 
never, never keep your bottles of perfume in your bathroom. Mm -hmm. And I know that's where you have them, most of you. Mm -hmm. Sorry, but I tell you why. Anyway, you can understand every day, of course, you take a bath or a shower. And you see what I mean, the temperature moves up, down, up, down, up, down every day, perhaps twice or three times a day. And the light may then change. Think about it. You mm. have in your bathroom clear bottles or little samples. After six or eight months, the color changes. Mm. It becomes strong or orange. Mm. And when you put it on white clothes, it's difficult to wash. It stays on. And the scent is no more the same. The difference is the concentration. Mm. When you buy an eau de toilette, you have only 6% essential oil with water and alcohol. Mm. So now you understand, if you have that at home, when you spray it, after one or two hours, it's gone. It's gone. Okay. All the perfume is 12% essential oil, less water and alcohol. Mm. So this one, you can spray it, you know, easily on your body, on your clothes, for the ladies in the hair. It will last on you till the beginning of the afternoon, but not all day long. And perfume is 20% essential oil, but there's no water, just the alcohol. So it's not stronger, it's just you don't use it the same way. If you have perfume, you can't spray it like that. If not, of course, we will follow you one mile behind the boat. <laughs> but you know, long years ago, there was, I'm sure you remember that, long years ago, there was a little crystal pipette inside of the bottle, and we had to do like this, you see what I mean? So today, it's micro sprays, much easier. When you spray once, you just get the drop that you need, but this, you can't put it all over, only on your pulse points. So, not here but really here, close to the hair. Mm. And then no more there, because with the COVID, we wash our hands too many times, and it's a shame because you throw it away yeah. there. Mm. And mm. it's the warmth yeah. of your body that is going to diffuse the scent. But four drops will be enough to smell nice from the morning till the night. <laughs> there you go. And in each of those three qualities, whatever the name you buy for men or for ladies, in each bottle, and that will surprise you as well, you have a minimum of 80 essential oils, 200 maximum. Oh, okay. mm -hmm. Now, when you see written on a bottle, rose, lavender, jasmine, this is what we call eau de Cologne. You have 3% of one essential oil. Mm -hmm. We sell that or for kids, I can tell you, this is my memory. You know, my grandfather and my grandmother, they had always at home eau de cologne, you know, to use after the shower to refresh themselves. But it's not like a perfume. It doesn't last, of course, 3%, now you know. But now you know which is which, okay? So now I would like to show you how now. Well, that, that explains it. That explains it. <laughs> I'm going to the lab. Oh, <laughs> Sorry for that. <laughs> uh, so, Madam, uh, here you can take photo, but think about it. When you buy a perfume, you buy the name of a designer, of a jewel maker, of an artist, retailer, for example. I mean, the name is on your bottle. And I'm sorry to tell you this, but it's true. The name makes you buy it. Thank you for them. That's why they have so much money. <coughs> but now I would like really to explain to you how it is. When a designer wants to get a new perfume, because before everything, he needs to meet seven, ten of those noses and explain to them what kind of perfume the company is looking for. He will get few samples, and if he falls in love with one scent, he will have to buy 
from the laws of the formula, which cost, you imagine, million and million of euros. With the formula in the end, he's a designer, he doesn't make any perfume. He comes in this town and he will choose one of the 30 perfume factories of France. You have to know, ladies and gentlemen, eight perfumes on 10 you buy from the old world are coming from this town. So we produce, we mix together with the formula, we send back to Paris in big jars, and in Paris comes the wonderful bottle. The wonderful <laughs> top, the market bottle. So the bottle, the top, the box, the name, the advertising, the one would give the advertising, marketing, transport. I'm talking about the empty bottle. Do you have an idea how much does it cost in percentage? 85%. I tell you right now that when you buy a bottle from the stores, you pay only 15% for what's inside. And I just told you we need one ton of rose to make one liter. How is it possible? Because when we buy one liter essential oil, it costs a lot of money for sure for the rose. But when you have in a bottle like that 150, 180 essential oils, sometimes it's only one drop or two drops. And in one liter, there's many drops. What I mean is with one liter, we make a lot of purchases. So you have to know that in here, we are a small factory. So we produce for, I have to say, four or five very famous names. But anyway, we are not able to tell you which company. It's forbidden, 100%. Even if you ask me, I will say, I don't know, I, it's not. So it's, you, you understand why. Because in here, we sell them with a factory bottle and with a factory name. So of course, we don't want that. You see what I mean? <laughs> but you know, for me, I don't use those. Because everybody wears that. What I use are the other ones that nobody knows. And what I like is, in here, if you want to reorder some more, you can do it from your country at the same price as here. But when you wear a Gallimard schools in France to become a nose, Paris, <coughs> Versailles, Montpellier, and here in Grasse we have three. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> You're talking about frog. We, we say, I have a cat, I need a mouse. <laughs> we say that in French. It's funny to, to see that you eat frog. <laughs> so you have to know that about the schools, if you are interested to go in such a school, or your kids, you have to know they have to study for five years to the university, three years chemistry, two years botanic. Not very easy. And then there's the test. In one hour, they have to recognize 150 essential oils. Can you imagine that? It's about one every two seconds and a half. You know, you can train your nose for that, but if you don't have the talent, it will be very, very difficult. Anyway, you will understand, per school, which are private, you imagine, there's eight students minimum, 12 maximum. It lasts one or two years. It costs 14,000 euros a year, which is okay to compare to Harvard or Oxford. But at the end of the year, from the six schools, only four or five will be famous perfumers. Everybody will get a job 100%. But you know what for? Aroma industry, you mean the food. Cosmetic products, you buy a shampoo, it smells of something. And you know the products you, we use to clean at home. You see what I mean? It's not so glamour and not so well paid and either. That's what it was the contrary. So if you think you have a good nose and a big one is not necessarily good, you mustn't smoke, you mustn't drink any alcohol, and you mustn't eat any spicy food. For the rest, everything is okay. <laughs> but you see what I mean, it's not so easy to become nose. But now you know why. So ladies, 
I thank you very, very much for your visit and your attention, and I wish you very nice holidays and a very good morning. Good morning. For example, you do? Oh, this is not so good. It's like yellow, though. This doesn't do it. It's a bright yellow, not this color there. Oh, that's the color. The lighting is so bright. That's where we were. Guys, it was amazing. Honestly, it was amazing, and I got to buy myself some perfume. And then I'm getting the catalog so I can buy some more at the same price. So now I'm in some four. It's a small little village. leaving you without talking oh wow this is so nice so we are in a little town a little village called San Paul very popular for a lot of galleries oh look at this hold on hold on look at this oh god Well, let's get a taste then. Oh, look at this one. Sorry. Mm. It tastes good.
Okay, I'm going to go down and I'm going to do a little bit of shopping. But also I'm going to have some lunch. I think I'm going to choose a cute little place where I can have some French crepe. This is usually good. Or I'll see what they have and then just have something to eat and do a little bit of shopping. Boy, the lighting under this tree is gorgeous. Okay, so I'm gonna go and get something to eat. Hello, hello, hello. We are back from almost eight hour tour. It was really good. The grasse, the perfume place. So I got me some. Got me some. What I was trying to say before I rudely got interrupted by my full memory space. Um, so I got myself some perfume and um, what's really nice is that I can actually reorder it online and it can pay the same price as I did in the um, perfumery factory. Yes, absolutely amazing. Absolutely amazing perfume. If you ever get a chance to actually go to Grasse and do the perfumery, go ahead and do it. If you love perfume though. But yeah, I really had a good time. So they're going to send us a catalog. You put your name down, they send you the catalog and they give you all the different ones they have. And then you can actually pay. It's very cheap. They were explaining like 85% of what you pay for is all the marketing, the box, the other brands. Because they actually make perfume for four famous brands, but they did not say which ones. And they're like, you know, literally the only per you only pay 15% for the actual perfume that's in the bottle so there you just pay for the 15% you pay for the perfume and not the glamorous box and the bottle and the advertising and everything else so it's a whole lot cheaper let me show you what I got amazing perfume I'm definitely going to be ordering my perfume from there from now on because it's like pure perfume it's not like you regular whatever is whatever is you can actually you can get the other perfume which is what I got I thought I got the perfume the actual oil perfume but I, I made a mistake but the next time I'm ordering it I'm going to order the perfume which is one the oil based one absolutely amazing that's what I want but anyway let me show you so it comes in that's why they gave us these because they make oils and um, I mean lotions and shampoos and everything. So this is like the soap, oh, that's nice. And then a um, a serviette towelette, refreshing towel. And then um, this is the perfume that I got. This shockingly enough. Honestly, didn't think I was going to like the smell of this perfume because I tried like five different ones. This one's got lavender. I am not a lavender fan. And this one was the one I liked the most. I don't know why. So this is a bottle that it comes in. As you can see, this was only 48 euros. Like literally, like in the store, you would pay over $200 for it. As she said, like literally. But yeah, this is a perfume. This is the odor perfume. Like I said, I wanted to get the actual perfume, but I made a mistake. Anyway, it's okay. So this one is 48 euros. And then the perfume, the oil-based one, is 68. Literally, 68. You're not paying an arm and a leg for like 300 or 400, 500, up to 500 dollars for it. You're just paying for the perfume. The actual thing can't wait for the catalog to come um, so I can have a look and see what more they have so I can order myself some perfume some real perfume it was very interesting like really 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 interesting absolutely an amazing event I mean what it takes to be a nose call it a nose perfume because you have to be able to be an amazing person like she was saying um, like 14,000 euros per year for the um, for the test uh, for the um, for the school I think you go is it five years 
I can't remember, it's on the video, like five years of, yeah, total five years, three years is chemistry and two years is botany or something. <clears throat> anyway, it's like a five year course, a degree in this 14,000 per euros. And then they only take a maximum of 12 people in a class. And out of those, only four are chosen to work in the actual perfume industry. Um, you all get jobs, you all get guaranteed jobs, but it might be in like a, a beauty industry, like in sort of like a beauty making like products and all of that, or somewhere else, somewhere else, but, um, or in a food place, but only like four get chosen to be like, um, the nose, they call them the nose. And part of the test, you have to be able to um, recognize 150 cents of essential oils in one hour or something. Something like that. You, look, you have to be able to smell 150 different essential oils within that period of time. It's crazy. And um, like 70% of women that, oh no, it, it's 80% of men that actually are in the industry for the, <clears throat> for the perfume, for the nose, but it's 70% of women that are very good as sommeliers. It's weird, right? It's so turned around, but anyway, it was really, really, really interesting. I really enjoyed it. Um, so yeah, I can't wait to get my perfume from there because I'm just going to get my perfume from there like i'm gonna see if i can try and get more because i wasn't sure i didn't want to take too much money and end up buying too much but now that i know what i want i'm definitely gonna buy more and they're gonna send the catalog like in december i gave them my address um so yeah i'm gonna be perfect <laughs> in a proper in a place where they actually make these perfumes because of these perfumes that you have in your brand stores they don't actually make them themselves they are made in grasse they have like um is it 30 30 30 it used to be 70 they said um factories is it factories as they call perfumeries um but now it's gone down to, it's gone to 30 and they supply most of the perfumes for the brands like all of these brands that um, buy perfumes, even the exclusive brands, they per they 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 um provide perfumes for them. They make the perfumes for them, and those brands just they tell them what they want, um the notes they want, and then they give them like they give them like the liters, and then they just put them in their bottles and they package them and they charge you an arm and a leg for it. And yet, if you buy from them, they even have the perfumes that they sell to those brands. Like, um, three of the perfumes, they've got a little box, which I think that's what I want to get. Six of, like, six in a box. Three of them, is it three or four, are the brands that they actually supply. So, they even have those perfumes from those brands. But obviously, they're not allowed to tell us which brands are those. So, for such a fraction of the price, it's insane. Paying 85, what, what 85% you're paying is just for the marketing and the bottle and the brand name. And you're only paying 15% for the actual perfume that you put on. That's insane. That is daylight robbery. Like, I'm just so annoyed. It's absolute daylight robbery. Like, I don't want to buy perfume anymore in a store. Like, I really don't. I'm just going to go and smell it and see what it has on the outside. And then I'm gonna go and just keep ordering from them. But literally, that's all I'm gonna do. Like, why am I paying 300, 400, 500 for a perfume where I can just get it so much less? And it's exactly the same thing. Why? Because it has a brand name? No. That is just not being an educated consumer. Oh my God, my husband will be so proud of me. Mm. Yes, I'm now an educated consumer, baby. <laughs> Yeah, so um, I'm going to wrap this day up. I'm actually going to take a walk around again. I'm going to take a nap and then I'm going to go out and have some dinner outside, I think. And yeah, and then it's time to get my clean. Leave any minute.